Everybody, said Farmer Grover. Welcome to Grover's farm. I was just feeding the horses. Aren't they cute and adorable? Moo, said the cows as Grover and Elmo sat down beside. After breakfast, Grover and Elmo. Moo, said the cows as Grover and Elmo. Early the next morning, the rooster crowed. Cock a doodle doo. Hello, everybody, said Farmer Grover. Welcome to Grover's farm. I was just feeding the horses. Aren't they cute and adorable? Elmo would love to help, said Elmo. I don't. Oh, we're done. That was a lovely book. Why are you holding your nose? Because Kika dookie. No, she didn't poop. Yes, she did. No, she didn't. Sometimes when we cook eggs a certain way, um, it can stink sometimes. What? What did you say? Sick. You want to see? Hi. <laughs> hi. Yeah. Say hi, guys. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Do your food first, silly. Um. Huh? <laughs> oh, good, you got it. You got it. Uh. <laughs> come here, come to the side. Hi. Say good morning, guys. Good morning. Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's vlog. It is a uh. nice Saturday morning. Sadly, Daddy's not around. He's working. Lucky. Daddy's working. He's planting. Planting season now, kind of. Um, the weather's been so finicky and stuff lately. It's it's just been switching back and forth. It'll get warm, and then we have like a week of colder weather, and then it gets warm again, and then we have a week of colder weather. And by warm, I mean like I think our our highest has been like s I don't know if it's even gotten to 70. It's been high 60s. And because of that, with the weather switching so much, my ears have been irritating me. Ears irritating me. So today, we're just gonna <laughs> Hey! Just taking it um, slow, slow morning. Um, I'm just trying to make sure that I don't get an earache. Um, but anyways, yeah, so Jaden is watching some cartoons and playing his iPad. This girl, it just, she just wants to attack me. She just wants to attack. Um, I just got done getting ready for the day and I think I'm gonna get her dressed and see if she will help me with a task. I need to unload the dishwasher and usually she likes to help me with like the silverware and stuff. So I'm gonna see if she wants to help me again. Right now she just wants to be tickled. I also need to vacuum, which always seems like the biggest task to do, yet it's interesting how um, keeping the floors cleaned makes the biggest difference in how your house feels. So like if, I, if I'm ever frustrated with how dirty the house is or stressed out because it doesn't feel clean, the first thing I'll do is vacuum and then I feel like a hundred times better. So there's a little tip if you feel like you need to get your house under control, uh, vacuum first because that will make it feel, it just makes the biggest difference, I don't know, maybe, maybe I'm just a weirdo, but try it and let me know if that's how you are too. Kiki? What? Let's get you dressed. And then, can you help mommy unload the dishwasher? 
dishwasher. We gotta put the dishes away. Well, first let's get dressed. We have ourselves a bit of a predicament. Do we have an unwelcome visitor? No. This thing no. does not belong in the house. Why Who let him in? in Who let the spider in? Daddy. He's moving! He's moving, he's going for the fan! Spider, meet Mr. Broom. What if he jumps on me, Jaden? Get him! Ah! Get him! Oh! Where'd he go? Ah! Ah! <laughs> I got him! Well, it has been quite an eventful Saturday so far. Thank you. <laughs> no, not on me. Ever since we've been getting warmer weather, I've killed like one spider a day. And I'm sorry if anybody watching this is like a fan of spiders. I am very much the opposite. And they do not belong in my house. What? They came back in the house from Orin. You, you let the spider in. I didn't let the spider in. He thinks I let him in. It's going down. Okay, you start. Do you have a leaf or no, I don't go fish. So this, we play this in an interesting way. He can't hold the cards on his in his hand. So he lays them out and I basically just, I try my best not to ever look at his cards. So I don't know what he has and we do play an honest game. But my problem is with this, cause she wants to play, but she can't yet. So I usually just try to let her hold our matching cards. Do you have P for pig? No, I don't go fish. Oh man. I picked it up! I got a match! Okay, so I'll give it to Kiker. Okay. Alright, now I'll go again. Do you have, um, do you have tea for turtle? No, I don't go fish. Okay. Alright, your turn. Do, do, I have, do I have an M for mouse? No, I don't. Go fish. Do I have an M for box? No, I don't. Go fish. Oh Here, my god, pick. did I just pick it up? You picked it up? Wow, you're so lucky. Do you have a D for ducky that goes squash? Uh, yes, I do. Do you have a um a, a U for umbrella bird? No, umbrella. I don't go fish. Dun 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 dun. She's already getting to work. What a good girl! Are you doing your chores? <laughs> She's just playing with the water. Uh, that's not how you put the dishes away. I need to sit on that. Give me back my ball. I need that for my office. Give it back. Give me back my ball, kid. Give me back my exercise ball. <laughs> Ha ha! <laughs> Victory! Nap time and lunch time is done. Nap time was a glorious one and a half hours. Uh, does anybody else nap with their kids? I feel like I've been napping with them like every day lately. Scratch that, this week I did not. Last week I think I slept with them every day. And um, part of me feels guilty. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, part of me does not feel guilty, and so I will probably continue napping with my kids when they nap. That's what they tell you when your kids are little, right? You nap when they nap, but somehow when they're older, you're not really supposed to stick to that. I, I don't know. What? Not yet. Let me relax for a little bit, okay? Just ignore the messy playroom in the background. Yeah, I don't think the dishwasher is ever gonna get unloaded. I'm hoping to just chill for a couple minutes and then maybe go and unload it but I want to do um, a little bit of editing. So I'm trying to encourage him to play and Kiki's watching Secret Life of Pets too for a little bit. I typically put a movie on right after they wake up for a nap to kind of let them chill and fully wake up and then um, play after that. So that is where we are at at 3.36 in the afternoon. Well, I did not plan that out nicely. I will be using my phone now because my camera batteries died. And I didn't charge them from the last time that I vlogged, which was like Easter. 
so I hope you guys don't mind that I'm using my phone, which at this point I have the iPhone 11 Pro, so the quality shouldn't be too bad. Um, for me, typically, I think when it goes to editing, when I look back on the footage, the only thing that I don't like about my iPhone is just the audio quality. Um, granted, I haven't looked into it, so I'm sure they have different things I could probably get to enhance the audio here on my iPhone, but it is what it is. She's coming. It's her! Beep, beep. Peekaboo. Your hair got crazy after nap time. I see you. Peekaboo. Peekaboo. I see you. Peekaboo. <laughs> can you help me unload the dishwasher? Grab one and give it to mommy. So I can put it away. Thank you. Thank you. So cute when she helps because it, give, it gives me like flashbacks of when Jaden used to help me do dishes. Thank you. Can you give me some more? Oh, thank you. Good helper. Thank you. <laughs> Your face. Do you like helping? Dinner time. Tell them what we're eating. Taco salad. Oh, don't show them. <laughs> and some of us, some of us, Kiki and I, well, I have broccoli salad, but she's been picking off of mine. She loves broccoli, which I have just discovered today. So it's really interesting. She's like my veggie eater. And that is not my veggie eater. <laughs> but I was just telling the kids, um, that after dinner, we're gonna go upstairs, and what are we gonna do? Um, um, put on pajamas and, and, and to, to, and to, and to, until we fall on, to, until we fall onto a lamp. What? <laughs> no. Remember mommy said that we're gonna go upstairs after we have dinner, and we're gonna go pick our clothes out for church, so that tomorrow morning we don't have to scramble and figure out what we're gonna wear, but we just put our clothes on. Isn't that brilliant? No, it's not brilliant. Kiki, is it brilliant? Hey. Oh no, we we already did pray. I got this book not too long ago. Um, uh, it's supposed to help like engage more com conversation around the dinner table, and so it has a bunch of questions. I think we've done it once so far. Um, so I'm going to ask Jane another question. The only thing is that like this book is geared more towards older kids, like at least older than Jaden. But I've been kind of just switching up the questions so that it's more, you know, his stage. So let's see what today's question is. If you could be any animal, what animal would you be? Um, a frog. That's an animal. A frog? You would be a yeah. frog? Look, look, watch me how I act like a frog. In her face and then watch. Go. Ready? Ready? Whoa. Then you jump up and down. Yeah. Why would you want to be a frog? Because I like, because I like frogs because cause it's so funny, funny <laughs> when they walk away because then I would just chase the frog and I was like, Frog, go back here. I'm gonna chase you. If you were a frog, what would you do all day? Um, would you like eat flies? I would like to hop like hop? a frog. You would just hop? Yeah. Super frustrated because I was totally just recording and talking uh, to you guys for a long time. Uh, and my camera just turned off, Jaden. Just yeah. randomly turned off. And um, I've been having this problem with the camera for a while now. And I think it just might be time to retire it. I don't know why it does that. But anywho, we finally made it upstairs. We're picking our clothes for church in the morning because it's just easier to pick it the night yeah, before. Yeah, Mom, Mom, um, you, you okay. bring this downstairs. You, I gotta pick you something else. That Mom. doesn't really match. So Kiki's well, gonna wear... I want the pineapple shirt. You want the pineapple shirt? Well, you have to get some jeans for that then. Kiki's gonna wear this cute little fox dress, Pizza long sleeve. Jeans? And then it's got these little, I don't know what you call these, little booty. I, I don't know the terms. 
Anywho, she'll wear that. And then I got her little white stockings because tomorrow's going to be like 54 and cloudy. She'll probably wear little boots. And that was easy. But I might have to pick, let me see, I might have to pick a different pair because those are kind of big for you. Oh, buddy, this is, this is a mess. You can't just leave your drawers open like this, okay? Because this is a big mess. Okay, so you have your shirt all ready. Let's do, uh, what kind of pants should you wear tomorrow? All right, we have your outfit and we have Kiki's outfit and we are good to go. Now mommy just has to figure out what she's gonna wear, which sometimes takes the longest. <laughs> So tomorrow's supposed to be a little chilly. I may end up wearing just this v-neck with this cardigan doohickey and then probably with some black skinny jeans and my black boots down there. Those ones. I'll probably wear those. Not like you guys cared or anything, but that's probably what I'm going to be wearing tomorrow. Oh. Hi. <laughs> You're so cute. You Hello. love seeing yourself, huh? Nana. Come here. Nana. Huh? Nana. We don't have any more Nanas. We ran out. Mommy has to buy more. She's not going to be very happy with me. She's very dedicated yeah. to her Nana every morning. And um, sometimes she'll ask for it as a snack later on throughout the day, but not not usually. So, But she does have her Nana every morning. Um, but anywho, uh, Daryl will probably be coming home soon. It's seven o'clock and then we're just gonna take the evening to chill with him. Um, we've hardly seen him all week this week. He's been pretty busy. Actually, I think we, he kind of took off and was really busy on Wednesday. So we did spend some time with him on Monday and Tuesday, but the kids really haven't seen much of him this last week. And so we're gonna be soaking up all of our daddy time and um, we will, just pick back up tomorrow. As I said, this will be like a little weekend vlog. So, um, so we'll see you guys tomorrow morning. Good morning, guys. Well, I thought I was hiding. I was gonna say I'm hiding in the corner of the playroom, but she found me, so not a very good hiding spot. So, as you can tell, we are not at church right now. When I ended the vlog last night, we were pretty sure that Daryl was gonna be coming home at a decent time and we were gonna spend the evening with him, but he ended up working super late and um he did he just he worked really late and um and then by the time he got home kiki woke up around that time and i had rocked her for like a half hour and tried to lay her down and she woke up again so then i rocked her again and she fell asleep and i tried to lay her down and she woke up again and i tried that for like an hour and it's just, I don't know why. I don't know if it's due to teething or if she just wasn't that tired. So yeah, last night was a bit frustrating. Just every time I rocked her to sleep and she fell asleep, I would go to lay her down and she'd wake up. And so finally I was like, I need sleep. So I brought her into our bed and she still just struggled probably for another half hour flopping around um, till she finally passed out. And then I passed out. I really had wanted to transfer her to her crib after she fell into a deep sleep in our bed, but um, I passed out as well, and so I woke up around like 6, I think, and was going to transfer her to her crib at that point. It was still dark, um, so I tried putting her in her crib, and she woke up again. So I went to the rocking chair, and I rocked her, and she fell asleep, and then I went back to her crib to lay her down. Once I laid her down, she woke up again, so finally I'm like, I just, I I'm so tired. I was like, I was rocking in the rocking chair and just praying like that she'd fall asleep and I could lay her down and then I was just feeling super emotional, super tired, so I started crying <laughs> like, what am I doing wrong? I can laugh about it now because I'm okay now, but I was pretty emotional and upset earlier, so eventually I brought her back into our bed, she fell asleep on me and I was like, forget it, I'm just gonna go to sleep and she's just gonna sleep in our bed. Yeah, so we woke up. I guess uh, 7.30 or something and decided that it was just gonna be better off for us to stay home and do a church service here at home and then um, just have like a family day because the kids really haven't seen much of Daryl all week. So yeah. that's what we're up to. Daryl actually, he was awake for about 20 minutes and then he went back upstairs to go to sleep again because he's really tired from this last week. So I have been trying to keep the kids happy all morning. We've been playing a lot, but they go through these spurts of being unhappy especially Kiki, and I'm sure it's because she's tired, so. 
that was a lot to unload on you guys. So, um, happy Sunday. Hey, what do you want to do today? What do you think we should do today? Hopefully Daddy will build your sandbox. We'll have to see how he feels when he wakes up. Do you want to welcome everybody to the vlog for today? Yeah, okay. Look at the camera. Say hi, guys. Oh, you hear the movie. Okay. okay. This says, under the sea. There's dolphins, and a walrus, and a sea turtle, and an eel. An octopus. Hey, it's okay. Jaden wants to see too. This has been a problem lately. Sea lion and a shark. Sandbox. But I still have to get the sand. Yeah, I still gotta get the sand. What do you think of it so far? Good. We're gonna mow around it because the grass is too hot. If we mow it, all be careful. Not to um, get run over. Yeah, that's true. That's very important. Yeah, not I to get run over. Yeah, I will make sure not to get run over. Uh, I will, yeah. I'll so you will yeah. get run over? No, 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 no. I'm gonna try not to get run over. Uh. Hello, princess. How was your nap? Good. Good, okay. Would you like to go outside? You want to go see what daddy's working on? Yeah, I'm coming. Do you want some help to go down the stairs? Okay. Hold my hand. Well. Good girl. Well. Good job. Well. Whoa. Woo. Well. Yay. She loves her daddy. Mm. Yeah, sandbox. Try it. If you can't, just set it down. What? You're recording this whole time. Now I feel like I have to carry it up there. Can mommy do it? If you can't make it, just set it down. Yeah! Don't hurt yourself, though. Camera back. Oh yay. Hey! What are you doing? <laughs> You're sitting? Are you gonna mow the grass for us? He takes the sandbox thing very seriously. <laughs> You're supposed to. <laughs> He's leveling it. I'm gonna put it on my neck. Today we're outside, and here's Dad. He's doing his work right here. That's been my sandbox, and he mows the lawn. And he's working very hard for you, right? He's been working very, very hard. And that is that for the sandbox, at least for now. He leveled out the dirt, watered it down so it gets packed down. Put the liner in there. We put rocks to hold it in place for now. 
And next step is for him to figure out where he's gonna get the dirt from, the sand. And uh, once we get that and put it in there, somebody's gonna be all ready to play. Is it spicy? Daddy was right, huh? <laughs> Just tried some of the salsa. Say hi, guys. Hi. We're at a Mexican restaurant. Huh. And Kiki loves the artwork, like on the seats and stuff behind us, which I think are really cool, too. That's the one that's behind Daryl and Jaden. And the table. I always love seeing the different artwork and stuff in the Mexican restaurants. Where's the parrot? Where's the birdie? Where is it? Oh, there he is. What else is there? There's a flower. Flower. Here's a palm tree. Yeah. Forgot to show you guys before we dig in. I got the um, the Texas fajitas. I've got like shrimp and chicken and beef. Oh God. Kiki got a coin dog and fries. Little American. Jada, what did you get? Oh, I'll wait till you're done chewing. Daddy got some sort of fancy tacos and a big old pepper thingy. I'm not even gonna try to pronounce that. <laughs> okay, Jaden, what did you get? Burrito, Baruti, and Tookie. Baruti and Tookie? Yeah. That's an interesting name. Well, mine's with taco, mine's with taco, Tookie. How's your food? Hey, is it good? Oh, you're trying to do thumbs up? Yeah, you like it. Hey guys, it's clearly the next day and I just realized that I forgot to end the vlog. So without further ado, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for coming along this weekend. We had a lot of fun and I'm super excited to get the kids sandbox up and going. Um, Daryl just has to buy the sand tomorrow, I think. I'm sure I'll be recording too once that gets put in and the kids, you know, get to play in it for the first time and stuff too. So stay tuned for that video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for coming along. As I said, if you did enjoy this video, please consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribing to our channel. We would love to have you. And you can also hit the um, notification bell if you want to be notified whenever I upload my, my latest videos. Um, with all of that said, I hope you guys have a blessed day wherever you are or a blessed night, whatever it is, and we'll see you in my next video.